Well, the Crooms Academy of Information Technology in Sanford is preparing students for bright futures in the tech industry. News 6 Morning anchor Bridget Ellison has more on the major event the school uses to help students in tonight's Getting Results in Our Schools. Getting Results in Our Schools, sponsored by Crayola Experience. This week we're in Seminole County at Crooms Academy for the Tech Fest. This is the 12th year for this event. It's an IT conference right here at the high school for the students where they're getting a glimpse at future opportunities. At Tech Fest, the future is presented directly to students at their school so they can start planning ahead. The whole goal with Tech Fest though is to bring the, the IT community into the school where the students can get one-on-one -on -one with them. Um, and also looking at options for secondary beyond high school. Tech companies along with the military and colleges meet one-on-one -on -one with students through workshops, booths and presentations. At Crooms, uh, we, we look to hire interns, if you will. We offer scholarships uh, to uh, students that are involved primarily in the animation, simulation, gaming area. Students say they look forward to this every year. Different simulation, programming, different internship opportunities that these businesses ha you know, actually have. I, I know friends that got internships through people that they met at Tech Fest, so that's, that's been a cool experience. Keynote speaker Simon T. Bailey calls Tech Fest Silicon Valley comes to Sanford, and he's proud to see how the historic school his family attended decades ago has evolved. And to see how much the school has progressed and how they're making a difference, not just in Seminole County, but certainly in the world. I've received certifications, I'm in an internship right now, and I'm um, understanding financial responsibility. There's just, um, Crooms has opened doors for me to just to be the best I can be. And the money raised through Tech Fest goes back into scholarships for Crooms graduates. Those awards will be announced in April. I'm Bridget Ellison, I'll see you in the morning. And more than $300,000 has been raised from the Tech Fest over the past 12 years to help create an endowment fund for student scholarships.